Some of the challenges we had without power was a night study for the students. Some of them used the torches to do their homework and assignments and all this stuff. The installation of the solar power really helped. We provide time for, for night study, that is from 6 o'clock up to half past 8, sometimes 9 o'clock. And then uh, when the students feel that they still have a lot to do, they go to the dormitories. So now we are proud that we have light in our dormitories to do our studies so that we can do well in our examination. They use light to stay overnight, prepare lessons, and then they use the machines that are available to run copies so that they can teach from here now to the prepared in the night. People, they used to come and do all sorts of things that is not right to the girls. So that's why we are afraid and we stay inside. And nowadays, some feel comfortable to go out around 9 o'clock in the night, 10 o'clock and 3 o'clock morning also to come out and do our studies. The European Union is proud to support Papua New Guinea in harnessing the power of renewable energy. Together with UNDP, we are committed to improving the quality of essential rural services by introducing climate-friendly and cost-effective energy solutions in the East and West Pacific provinces. <laughs>